Recently, a team of archaeologists uncovered something in a necropolis close to Cairo that has them questioning everything they thought they knew about ancient Egypt. As they excavated the Fayum Oasis necropolis, located west of the Nile River and 60 miles south of Cairo, they stumbled upon the bones of an eight-year-old child, carefully laid out among the remains of 142 dogs. The Center for Egyptological Research of the Russian Academy of Sciences, who made the discovery, stated that burials like those discovered by the center's specialists are not typical for Egypt. But the strangeness doesn't stop there. The child's remains were found with a linen bag placed over their head, adding yet another layer of mystery to this already perplexing discovery. The team believes that the mass burial of dogs may indicate a synthesis of religious and magical ideas of the Egyptians and foreigners living in Fayum, which gave rise to new forms of ritual practice. As the team delved deeper into the discovery, they found clues that could shed light on what happened to the child and the dogs. Blue clay commonly found in ancient Egyptian reservoirs was found on the dog bones, leading scientists to believe that a catastrophic flood may have been responsible for their deaths. The child's involvement in the burial is still a mystery, but archaeologists theorize that the child may have been caring for the animals at the time of their sudden demise. This discovery, located near the ancient Egyptian town of Crocodilopolis, home to the crocodile guard Sobek, adds yet another piece to the puzzle of ancient Egyptian life. The team has spent years excavating the Fayum Oasis Necropolis, uncovering graves dating back to the 4th century BCE. As we continue to uncover these graves, perhaps we will finally unravel the secrets of the past and discover the fate of the young child and the dogs.